Adesso questa la mettiamo sulla spianatoia, un altro po' di farina. Ok, now she's got a little bit more flour here on the table and she's pouring the, the batter onto there because she's going to start kneading it. Of course, by hand, as they say. You know, Rosa is the best <laughs> cook in Roga Casale. I think Rosa. <laughs> we think she is. She says she likes to cook, and that's probably why her things turn out so nice. Because she puts all her love in. Mm -hmm. oh. Okay. Okay. Done with this. <coughs> Now she's just going to carefully put all that other flour into it, knead it. And in the meantime, I'm going to get the pan ready. So you need carta de forno. Am I in the picture? You need carta de forno. <laughs> <laughs> you need carta de forno, which is parchment paper. So Rosa is telling me that traditionally, or some people, use, um, will leave time for the levitation or the rising of the, of the pasta. This is called pasta, right? Or pizza? Is this called pizza or pasta? Pasta. Come gnocchi. Ma mi dai dici tu? Come dici la Margarita? No, pasta. come si chiama quella? La pizza di Pasqua. Pizza di Pasqua. So, this is actually called the pizza, even though we think of pizza as something we eat with mushrooms and pepperoni on top. Ah, sì, sì. But, <laughs> but this is also called pizza. So, usually they let it rise two times, but Rosa is, only does it one time. And some people even let it rise overnight. But... Um, Rosa only does it one time. Is this best done on a wooden surface or on a marble surface? E meglio con marmo? Marmo più le tagliatelle. Ah, okay. Qua va bene il legno. This is, uh, to make this, it's better that you use a wooden surface rather than marble. Marble, she uses a marble surface when she makes uh, pasta tagliatelle and different kinds of pasta. Yeah, okay. mm -hmm. okay, so cut it in half. So you have two pieces. So she's putting flour on the table so that it doesn't stick while it's rising. Okay, she's putting it right in the pan. do two of these today. One will have trenza. Come? Trenza. Quelle? Trenza, si, si. Trenza, which is like braid. Trenza in Italian is braid, so she's going to braid this one, so we'll have two. Okay, so Rosa wants me to put a towel on the top of this one, and then we'll set it aside. And we'll have the other one where she's going to make it into a braid. Yeah. 
si facciamo una breccia ok so here she's gonna make the braid so you cut it into three pieces Roll it out a little bit, each piece. Okay. Okay, there, so you can see. Is that better? Here comes the fun part. <laughs> oh, fun. Just like my hair. <laughs> oh, I love it. Okay. It's beautiful. Good. I so. Bellissima. Ci mettiamo una towel. Adesso mettiamo anche l'altra. Okay, so now um, we're going to put some the, of this egg yolk on the top with the brush so that it will be a really nice brown. Oh, here's the egg yolk. 